and they are never cheap. They they start at like twenty five thousand. I didn't get anybody to admit a lower number for the sort of thing y'all do. Javier says. 6000 actually, 3500 for a tour, 2500 for a plane ticket, plus spending money, plus several tours until you find that special one, equals twenty-eight dollars to $30,000. All right, well, let's unpack that one a little bit. Um, first of all, yeah, our tours can be right around 3500 but that includes so much. I mean, the hotel for um, at least six nights, and then you've got breakfast every morning, airport pickup, but then let's get to the matchmaking, the socials, and then the unlimited one-on-one introductions and all the staff that's working with you. You're giving your own matchmaker for five hours, both nights at the social, that's 10 hours of individual matchmaking. And then the opportunity to tap into this and meet hundreds and hundreds of different women. It is by far the best value in singles travel today. So the plane ticket doesn't have to be 2,500 if you do any kind of decent shopping. And then, yeah, you're gonna spend some money while you're there, there's no doubt about it. So, but you'd spend money on a vacation anyway. And I always tell guys that, you know, you have to look at this as somewhat of a vacation because you're in a different culture. You're in this wonderful place where the women are at, and it's better than a regular vacation, vacation because the women are taking you and showing you places that most tourists will never see. So you're getting the inside on everything. And so it's really, really cool. Um, so, and then, you're saying, but I got to go several times where I find someone. Well, that's not necessarily true either. I mean, some guys will go on one tour, meet the woman of their dreams, and end up doing the fiance visa. That happens, I can almost guarantee you that out of the 20 some guys that are going to be there, five to six guys and maybe more will start the fiance visa process shortly while they're there or shortly after with the woman they met on that first tour because that happens all the time. And we've <clears> never <throat> met anyone who took your multiple. The guys who, what people don't quite get is the guys who take the multiple tours, they are absolutely the last dudes to ever complain. No, they love it. That's they, why they're doing it again, they, they, because they enjoyed it so much. Really, they would see the value in it. It's so much better than doing like a club med vacation or a vacation traveling on your own. And it's the same cost, if not less, than a regular vacation. So, but, but have you are, if you don't have the money, to yeah, do don't this, do then yeah. don't do it and, and do something, because this isn't that much money. And if you're really going over to maybe start a family, then hey, you know, it's probably something you're not ready to do. Wait until you have a little bit better financial situation and then do it. But I will also tell you, if you're gonna go out and you're gonna play the game in Scottsdale and some other places and you're gonna date, you're gonna drop thousands of dollars as well. You just don't count it the same you, way. Well, no, but if you go into Scottsdale and oh, you go buy a table, yeah. With bottle service, that could be eight to ten thousand dollars in one night, and I know because I've seen it. So you know, it depends on what you're going to do and how you're going to date. Everyone's different, so yeah, keep that in mind. But there, if you really look at all the value that's packed into these tours, other than just meeting the women, which is, an, I mean, if you were to pay a matchmaker here in the United States for this kind of exposure and this kind of assistance. Oh, you'd um, be a hundred thousand uh, dollars. Yeah, yeah. I yeah. mean, it's amazing the when amount you, of money they will charge you. Yeah, there's. It's. I've. I was a speaker uh, at iDay, which is the well was before COVID, was the oldest and largest internet dating conference, and I met a lot of the matchmakers in the United States, and they generally only work in LA, Los Angeles, uh, big cities. And they are never cheap. They they start at like twenty five thousand. I didn't get anybody to admit a lower number for the sort of thing y'all do, the in depth, you know, real look. Right. And even then, they're not. They're going to introduce you to a handful of women, and that's going to be it. And um, no, it's 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 not it's, even a comparison. It's a whole different thing. And you don't get a trip out of it. And you don't get a trip out <laughs> of it. Travel to exciting places and meet hundreds of stunning single women. Check out our website at thailand-women.com.